guys and welcome to a new video with Abe and Medu. Um, today we'll be unboxing another Furby. Um, I'm not sure if it works. It's probably gonna be a Furby Connect and I'm probably gonna use it for testing more than actually playing with it. And I might not talk much this video because I'm not feeling so well lately, but um, yeah, I'll do my best. So uh, let's get to unboxing. This is a pretty weird box to put a Furby, but okay. It would have been nice if I had scissors. There we go. in a bag. Two bags actually. Let me take this out. There's a lot of packing from. Oh, it's actually a Furby Boom. Guess what, guys? Styrofoam. That's not a bold reference. Anyways, I'm gonna be showing the Furby real fast. Here he is. He was um, packed very well. But he looks, um, best to say, kind of messed up. But we're gonna, we're gonna brush him. Hold on, let me find my brush. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna return him. Oh, his battery cover wasn't even attached. Okay. I'm just gonna brush him a little bit and then I'm gonna put him back on screen. Is this better? He looks much better now, but still is a little bit messed up. Uh, I think we're gonna get to testing after I brush his tail a bit. Uh, and let's check how much corrosion it has. Mm, I'll say a medium amount of corrosion. I'm not sure if you guys can even see, but let's test them now, see if anything's broken. I have replacement parts for absolutely anything that could be broken, I think, so um, we could basically fix anything if anything went wrong. Last battery. Nothing's happening at the moment. Let me try giving him a reset. Hmm. 
Nope, nothing's happening. The corrosion might have spread a little more during the shipping. I'll try cleaning it, and I'm gonna be back if I manage to get it working. If not, it will still be a part of my collection. It will just be for display. But I'm gonna try putting batteries in again and see if it catches. Oh, we got something, we got something. Sounds a bit weird, but it works. Luca, not so his name is Luca. Oh, I literally just tapped on his head and he started changing. Wah, Coco. Well, that was a really easy change, but I mean, I don't mind it being sweet. <laughs> we got everything. Now he speaks much louder. I'm not sure what happened. But at least he works. I'm still gonna clean some of the corrosion because I don't want it spreading. So it actually is English. Let me try feeding it. Oh, nice to know that works. Let me try pulling the tail. That works too. So I'm gonna test now how sensitive it is to movement. I wanna see if it's one of those sensitive furbies. Let's put him to sleep. I'm gonna put him to sleep. And see how easily it wakes back up. Okay, it fell asleep with his eyes open, for some reason. Let's see, how much does it take to wake this guy up? Will it move? Will it move? I don't think it's one of the sensitive ones. Well, it's actually not. It actually doesn't wake up easily. Well, that's great news, because I don't like Furbies that just... At the smallest touch, you just go like this and it wakes up. Uh, I have two of those. I had two of those. I only have one now. So, um, I guess it's safe to keep this guy with batteries inside. But I'm, not, I'm still not gonna do that, because I'm not gonna really play with it much. But still, glad to have him. Let me take the batteries out of it waking up. There we go. So yeah, the corrosion causes a, a few problems. Uh, with it waking up when you put the batteries in, but once it catches, it's gonna turn on. I'm gonna clean it a bit, and we're also probably gonna rename him. Yeah, give him give him a new name in the app. But now, look how how open the eyes are. This is how he fell asleep. So if you guys look here, there's some corrosion at the base of every single contact almost. we're gonna clean that up so there's no worries and at least we know it works and I'm also gonna uh, brush him some more and maybe find a way to paint these back because as you can see they're really decolored at the end they're like white instead of yellow that's supposed to be there but still with this guy I'm only gonna need about two or three more crystal furbies to have the whole edition the whole, the whole collection of Crystal Edition Furbies. So, um, yeah, thanks for watching this unboxing. I hope you, you guys enjoy this guy, and you wait to see more of him. Thanks for watching, and goodbye.